I don't even know what to fucking call this video, I'm pissed. Pissed at the cacophony and the fucking organic portals movement, the most important spiritual movement in the world. Pissed off that it doesn't even have many views, which shows you every spiritual person doesn't know what the fuck they're doing. They're not spiritual, they're all the fucking fake woke. All these new age fucking scum. You know what, when I was on Facebook, I, I went into so many accounts... I had all day guys, like while you were working in like from 2010 to like 2016, 17, I just had all day. I was just on Facebook all the time and what, what happened was I traced down a lot of um, like Illuminati styled like accounts <clears throat> and I would see their connection into the new age group of people and I was heavily embedded in there. My website's conscious a zine. It was meant to be like a conscious-based movement, and it was. But then you had this, and the new age is real. It's just an age, a procession of equinox. It's just an energetic change. That's how I see it. But there were so many, like, the false people. that So many of them, and they were doing it so wrong that, you know, now the new aspirants and young people just think the whole new age thing is fooey and shit. That's how bad a job you guys did. For someone like me, I'm a real new ager. I really hold the new energies fully. I fully understand the fifth dimensional nature. Well, not fully, but you know what I mean? These people can't even talk about it. So if they can't even talk about it, they're not spiritual. They don't have their own mind. They can't even speak. They can't even think. That's what I'm going to call this video, I think. To be spiritual, to be spiritual, I don't know the title yet, something along the lines of to be spiritual, it, it doesn't matter about fucking drinking, smoking, swearing, behaviours you do, yes, it can all lead to becoming more spiritual, veganism is not, you know, ascension, that's how they all act, you see that, they all act like, you know, veganism's ascension, not swearing means that you know more than someone who swears. These are all er absolutely irony. This is 100% erroneous. How come I know more than them and I can swear all day? Yes, sometimes if you push it too much, it can lower your vibration. Right? And anything that lowers your vibration, like these beers, they're not mine, by the way. That's not my... I wasn't staying here. I stay over here. <laughs> So, like these beers, for instance, that's Corona's there. <clears throat> Corona is my favorite beer, but um, you know, I don't really drink much anymore sometimes. And if I do, it's one or two beers. I never, ever get drunk anymore. I, I can't hold that frequency, you know, I, and you get way too dehydrated, even after two beers. Yeah, I've tested all this <laughs> in the last, you know, five, ten years. I tested everything for myself. I didn't just listen to everyone. I tested everything. Every concept in the spiritual movement I've tested. You name it, I've tested. Oh, I went vegan. Yeah, I did the vegan thing without even vegetarian. How come, you know, most people, I don't know, there's a lot of people turning back from veganism. It's because it's a reset. If you stay vegan, it will give you genetic defects. Why? Because we've spent millions of years eating fucking carcasses off the ground, you moron. Lion kills and blah blah blah. We've spent so long eating animals that our body is integrated in that fashion and in one generation you can't just flip it around. How fucking stupid these people are. I just can't fucking believe it. They can't think for themselves. That's the core of spirituality. Being vertical in your own think. In your own light column. That means you have to think for yourself. Otherwise you're not spiritual at all. So yeah, you can have a beer. They're not mine, but... You can have a beer, you can have, <clears throat> you can smoke cannabis and be spiritual. There's some people out there who are like, oh, psychedelics are evil. They're the way. Because the universe is psychedelic. This thing is morphing. In front of your eyes, you can watch a tree grow and morph. These people can't even see what is in front of their fucking eyes. Why the fuck are you listening to them? Oh, don't swear. <laughs> Yeah, if you do it too much, for instance, like, 
you'll feel the vibration. If you feel the vibration lower, then you've done it too much. It's the same with any of these things, drinking, smoking, swearing, whatever it is. But, um, yeah, I don't know, I'm pissed. Kind of had a video taken down today. Got some annoyance out here grounding, getting the anger out of my liver <laughs> so it doesn't store there. <clears throat> That's another point. And they're like, well, you can't get angry. That means you're not enlightened if you get angry. Yes, there's, there's something to, you know, um, seeing the reason for things and admitting it, and then you get much less angry, right? But sometimes you have to rile yourself up to even get up and move to get the adrenaline pumping. So anger is not erroneous. That's another point. It's these same people that say all these things, psychedelics, drinking, smoking, swearing, anger, that they're all, you know, that means you're not spiritual. How can he be spiritual? <laughs> because I'm a spirit, you fuckhead. That's what spiritual means, to be a spirit. Which means like thinking for yourself, acting for yourself, not just going, oh, I'm not allowed to eat meat because they all said so. That's robotic in action. That's not spiritual. Yeah, yeah, I get it, right? You eat lighter foods and you feel lighter and you can get more in your light body. I do this all the fucking days of my life, all the time, right? I've never been just like a, a crazy carnivore or something. But, <clears throat> yeah, I eat meat sometimes. You know, it has things that plants don't. That's why I do it. <laughs> Fuck, it's like this shit is right in front of their eyes and they just they can't see it. It's right in front of them and they can't see it, which means they're looking around it and they're ignorant. They're ignoring what's in front of them then, isn't it? If it's right in front of your eyes and you don't see it, you're ignoring it. Or you're blind, and ignorance is a blindness. Anyway, I'm pissed. So there's so much cacophony now coming in the organic portals movement. I'm ready to call it that organic portals are now entering the organic portal search term. You can tell the NPC movement on the videos lately. Like, <clears throat> just videos which explain nothing are up the top of the, uh, the search term of the movement. Like if you type organic portals, that's what I mean, the search term, the, the, uh, the moniker. And have you seen it? Like just like there was that 30 second like organic portal video where the guy says absolutely nothing. And that video just stayed up the top of the search term for like months. And I was like, why, why is everyone rushing to this video? It, it doesn't even tell them anything. You know what I mean? So like people are not even thinking properly. People can't even think anymore. Oh, you think, you think uh, I'm wrong? Watch this next 10, 20 years. It's going to be gnarly. Man, it's going to be bad. Oh, I just have so much like sorrow already because I can already see what's coming. Like these re-education camps in China and stuff. Crazy. Have you been watching this stuff? You guys need to watch this stuff. Everything that's happening in China is what they're going to implement around the world. Remember it said that when the elite change happened to the white dragon family? I did that video like a year ago. <clears throat> There's been like a change in power of the elite structure like from, I don't know, Illuminati, whoever it was, like all the, um, uh, what are they called, like the um, Rockefellers and all that, you know, from them sort of people over the Westerners to the East now. And you can even see that, you know, they added the Chinese currency into um, the SDR, the special drawing rights. What the fuck's that about? Chinese currency is weak as piss. Why is it, you know, <laughs> there should be way, way more other currencies in there than the Chinese currency. And obviously it's just because of the population size and what they think is going to happen. Like, you know, they're urbanizing and all that. But um, I think there's something more to it is what I'm saying. Like, and there's been this handover of power to the White Dragon family, who actually allegedly have nature in mind. Apparently they have, you know, nature in mind. They're not totally retarded and, you know, realize that, oh, hold on, we need nature because it's where we get everything. Fuck. Thank God. <laughs> what a tiny move these organic portal people make, though. 
Like their steps are baby steps. They're baby humans, remember? They're new humans. They were animals. They completed like the animal experience of, I don't know, they were a tiger. Now they're like a, a human and you can see the tiger archetype in the person. Well, they were a goose. Now you can see the goose archetype in the person. So a super evolved human like myself, it's why you guys can't see my archetypes. Because I'm so far away from that, like I don't have giraffe archetype anymore. I don't have hippopotamus archetype anymore. You can't see my animal resonances because they're so far away. Do you see it? <clears throat> You'll notice this with all, like the the very uh, very unconscious OPs, the lowest vibrational 2D ones, the 2D organic portals. Like it's very obvious in them. They're the very new ones. They've only just entered the 2D group soul of the organic portal homo sapien, I don't know, morphogenic field or whatever it is. Anyway, so like when you see like a fully complex complexity, not like myself, you can't even, that's why people can't even tell me, like they don't understand me, they can't see me, and since they can't judge me, they don't know. Well, I can't like his video because I can't understand. You know how many people have actually said that to me? People actually say that to me. So I'm not just like pulling this out of my ass. People say to me, oh, I can't understand you. I'm like, what? The fuck do you mean you can't understand me? I'm using English. Figure out the fucking words. What the fuck is the problem? This is what I'm trying to say. They, they, they don't have this deeper level of thought, these people. They need to judge from the surface because they are the surface. So if they can't see you act in a certain way consistently they can't judge you that's how i am you guys can't judge me properly because i don't act so consistently so you're like oh he's fake that's what they'll say <laughs> i'm realer than real baby <laughs> what i'm saying is true you can't judge me and then if you're like that i'm warning you you're not able to think for yourself you don't belong on this channel and no wonder i have you know not a hundred likes per a hundred views. No wonder. I'm starting to to see, you know, more and more that this whole place is some kind of, you know, I don't know. I want to say it like evil contraption. I think even nature is a lure. It had me. Okay, it's beautiful. It had me. I think the grip is finally released after thirty something years. Took me 30 years to really see that and remember where I am and stuff and what's going on. And this organic portals movement is super enlightening. I'll tell you what, hey. I think it's the most important um, spiritual uh, aspect movement because, and, and I think that's obviated by it coming at the end. I'm going to make a video soon. Why did not all the, all the previous masters, like you know, even the Eckhart Tolle type people, why don't they talk about organic portals? Why did no yogi of Tibet talk about organic portals, etc.? I'm going to make that video soon, so I'm not going to spoiler it right now. But one reason is, I think, because of the progression. Like, here we are at the end, in the apocalypse, and apocalypse means to uncover. Mm. And so, here it is, you know, the most important thing being uncovered, soul and spirit. Where else does it end? You see what I mean? It's the most important. It's like soul and spirit. What, what do you say from there? Maybe, or oh, the larger universe, like other light realms and stuff, but that's it. You know, veganism, fucking high vibration, whatever else you want to talk about, new age, all of that's way below, way below organic portal idea. You see that? That's why it's come at the end. You have to understand all this other stuff, and then bang, you get the, the full apocalypse. It's revealed. <laughs> it's gnarly. <laughs> you know, because, and it has to happen that way, because if it happened, I don't know, a hundred years ago or something, you know, it just, too many people would have ignored it, not believed it, so on and so forth. You might not have been able to um, see it, triangulate it in your mind, and so on, you know. Oh, anyway, that was a good, good venting rant. Thank you for listening. <laughs> now, look, I, I want to reiterate, yeah, I'm pissed, but now I'm grounding, I'm getting better. <laughs> but um, I want to reiterate, you know, I'm, I'm still pissed, like, uh, you know, I'm still very annoyed by this very much daily, <laughs> every friggin' day.
It doesn't end here, eh? The misery does not end. I've, I've not wanted to be in this, like, world on Earth, in physical reality, whatever you want to call it. I've not wanted to be here for so long. When I was younger, yeah, I did try to kill myself once, tried to bleed out in the gutter and woke up in the morning and my, my cuts on my arm were cauterized. I think I still have some scars. There's one. Where is it? There. Punched through some glass, which I'm not recommending when I was younger. Oh, girls, mate, you know, women. I'll tell you what. She was going for my one of my friends after we just broke up. What a fucking whore. Anyway, <clears throat> just want to reiterate that, you know, like swearing, anger, and, and all that, and, you know, that doesn't mean you're not spiritual. Like, yes, there's a lot to say about it, you know, in, in the light of, you know, if you stop those things or at least recede them or become aware of them, like, and only use the word, say, fuck, in the right context as an um, ambiguous word, not just like every second word. <clears throat> if you use it appropriately, you know, you can still use that. But yeah, yeah, we should be moving away from all that and moving higher. I get it. But I'm telling you, those same people, you know, those people that are like, you know, anger's erroneous. Um, I don't know, veganism is ascension. How come they don't have their own mind? Just think about it for a second. How come they never, ever give anything? They do not give anything. If they don't input anything, any novelty, they're not a spirited human. And you're like, oh, but Ben, I know I'm a spirited human and I, I haven't done any novelty. Yet that's because the world is this way and it's pushing us to not be. I'm just generalizing here. Right? It's philosophy. But have you noticed, like, so in other words, I can give you an absolute statement. If they can't think for themselves, they're definitely a spiritless human. So if, but what I'm trying to say in this video is those people, those fake woke ones that say, oh, you can't swear, you can't do this, you can't do that, you can't do that, or you can't do that. Because if you do those things, you're not spiritual. They're fake woke. They're not fully woke. I don't realize where they are. You know... They don't realize what's going on around them. They never stop it. They never rebel. If they don't rebel and they're part of the system, that means they're part of the system. And more and more, I think you and me, guys, we're all seeing, right, that this place is uh, more than meets the eye, you know. I'm even starting to think nature is so pretty that it's like a lure for spirits, this realm this place is like a lure like when you go lure fishing for a fish it goes ooh that's a pretty fish I'm gonna eat that bang it winds up on your dinner table <laughs> I think that's pretty similar to the beauty of nature here we're winding up on some I don't know someone's dinner table right all this loose luciferians maybe it's Lucifer's dinner table after all right maybe this is a fallen realm and that's all it is because it's definitely mechanical definitely every day you know like the creation process is 100% stifled <laughs> everything should be so much smoother if you can imagine it <clears throat> you know we should be able to just make it you don't need a hundred iterations of the iPhone get the flying talking phone and then that's it make that get the get to the end state <laughs> I guess I'm just a shaman who always sees the end, huh? I'm telling you the shaman is a completed type of human. I mentioned before about, you know, seeing resonances and archetypes and why you guys can't see me. It's the same thing when you look at Terence McKenna or one of these other type of like full on, you know, full shamans. Not just like the medicine man, but like a proper shaman is medicine man, philosopher, like... I don't know, cognitive scout has the ability to walk into any grid of experience, can turn into a giraffe in one second, can become the lion in another second. The organic portal is stuck in the grid.
they only when you look at them have the tiger resonance or only have the giraffe resonance because they're a new human right <clears throat> i hope you guys can see that can you guys see why do i get such low likes why am i being like always pushed away what, what's going on who's brainwashed you ask yourself Oh, but I don't like you because you don't like one of my friend's channels. <sighs> okay. I mean, I almost could say fair enough, but if I was stupid, I would say that. So I'm not going to say fair enough because it's not. Because it doesn't matter who the messenger is. You should only be seeing and searching for the message. If it comes through Benjamin Kallenberg or not. If it comes through, I don't know, Joe Smo. John Smith, whoever the fuck gives you the message, you don't worry about the messenger. You don't shoot Ben and go, oh, Benjamin smokes cannabis. That means he's not ultra enlightened. I'd say, I'd beg to differ, but you know what I mean? They say this stupid shit like that. Or he swears. He's not enlightened. He's not a master because he swears. These people don't know anything. They're illogical. They don't fucking know what they're talking about. That's why they don't give you anything. They don't create. They're not creators. They don't enter any novelty. They can't even think for themselves. They're using other people's thoughts. The fuck are you listening to these people for? This is now happening. Like, there's such cacophony in the organic portals movement. It's really starting to piss me off. It's only going to increase, I can tell. Oh, well, I'm glad I got, you know, my base videos out there. We've done a lot of number one of like a lot of series, mini series that I'm going to hopefully end up producing if you guys keep supporting me. Otherwise, what can I do? You know, like if I'm up against a million NPCs who want to say I'm wrong, which is what I have a feeling where this whole movement is going into annihilation. I just, I can't see the organic portal movement really surviving in a world full of organic portals, you know what I mean? So I think we really have to, um, it, and you see, it comes down to thinking for yourself. You're going to have to ignore likes, dislikes, views, all of it. I gave you a good example before. There's, there was like a video up the top of the, the search term for like months, and it was a 30 second video not telling you one thing. Just it mentioned the word organic portals. He was like, "Ah, oh, these people, man, they're soulless," and that's all he said. <laughs> that didn't give you information. You, you see that or not? I hope you see that. Oh my god! <laughs> Do you see what information is? Are you still alive? Fuck! But that's proof, right? You know, the reason that video was up the top of the search term is because everybody, because it was there. Because everyone goes, oh, that's the top video, that must be the top video. It was a 30-second video. How can you think that's going to be the top video in the, in the whole search term? So you're not, you're not thinking right, guys, you know? No wonder we, we have the world in the state it is. People can't even think for themselves or, or think accurately. <sighs> anyway, I don't want to just bash you guys all day. Sorry, I'm, I'm, I have my down days too, you know? We are not just ascending. Never forget that. That's another thing that these same people have. I don't know what to call these people. Because, you know, some of them are not fake work. It's just everybody infected with the virus, it seems to me. Yes, like the Agent Smith virus to the conformity virus, you know what I mean? That's what it seems to be. So there's no real label I can throw on these people. Yet again, you're going to have to think for yourself and see it when it appears in front of you. It's the only way to navigate now because there is such a cacophony in the world. You have to be able to feel, and it's through your heart, guys, as well. The neurons in your heart, there's not just neurons in your brain, and you know, oh, the higher sense of feeling energetically with your chakras and so on and so forth. Yeah, anyway, I see a lot of cacophony now entering the organic portals movement, which is also like adding to my woes. At the moment, look at me pacing back and forth. <laughs> I'm like a mad scientist, eh? <laughs> Just pacing back and forth. <laughs> but, you know, it's these same people, they're like, oh, anger's erroneous and stuff. Yeah, I get it. Like, you, anything that lowers your vibration, 
kind of brings you out of vision and brings you here into body and which is an organic portalization process not thinking for yourself I don't know drinking lots of beer lowers your vibration whatever even if I do smoke too much I can yes you can wind up lowering your vibration but you have to feel this I hope one day to be able to get like a perfect schedule for marijuana but guess what it won't ever exist because everybody's different plus every day is different well there's the best reason ever why veganism is not forever for everyone by the way why because change is the only constant that's why bam you're wrong and you just got told you're wrong in one sentence now what are you gonna do are you gonna feel for yourself or maybe you need some adrenochrome that day from some like cow meat I barely ever eat this stuff and you can get very far away from it and you're like well how can you go back to it yeah once you get very high vibe in your food it's very difficult to like eat a piece of meat and not feel sick yes I've been there I have done that I know what you're talking about but how come I still have vision I still have vision now I could eat meat for like I don't know every day for the next month and I'd still have vision after that month I'm sure I would start to feel it and I would start to have distorted vision but this is what I'm trying to say that if you're a spirit you can endure more so the OP the organic portals who like think that veganism is ascension and you know sometimes they even have a different blood type like a B or something where it's more suitable for them <laughs> and they don't even research this stuff those those same people they'll they'll not be able to think for themselves so you dismiss all of that you, you know you don't dismiss it you know you take it in as like extra information okay veganism you know is going to increase my vape vibration so if I want to get more vision this month there's a special I don't know event called 21st of 12th 2012 the eschaton center coming I'm going to push it all through so you line up your psychedelics you line up in what order you're going to take the psychedelics you know <laughs> you, you start eating higher vibration into the event but after the event you crash down so maybe that's the time that you would reinstill physical body strength and eat the bit of meat for instance see you see it so I I think you know we need a much more complex model for all of this stuff it's not just as black and white as they all like pretend it to be and um, you know they always they always act like you know if something works for them it's gonna work for you but we're all different in just so many ways it's puzzling <laughs> so I mean how can they even, they're ignoring like thousands of ways that we're different some of these people you know what I mean <laughs> These are not, you know, these are not um, people to hold up as gods or something. Anyway, I just wanted to get that off my chest about the, the people who say you can't do this, you can't do that and be spiritual. They're wrong. They are wrong. I'm going to put that to you plain and simple. They're exactly wrong. Some of the things they say can help you, but that doesn't, doesn't mean their entire philosophy is correct. Like to say veganism is for everyone forever, that's incorrect. You see what I'm saying? So, and all the best people in the world know this, so I don't really care about the dislikes that land on this video from a few hapless people that haven't even considered this stuff. Um, I don't know what to call this video, what it's going to be end up called. Maybe cacophony. I might just call it cacophony. <laughs> what do you reckon? I think so. Because that's what's going on, like the, the squawking, the squawking of the philosophy without the real thinking. That's what cacophony always comes across to me as. Like lots of competing yelling and sounds, like that's what the word to me means. So I think that's what I'm going to call the video, cacophony. <laughs> um, yeah, to do with the o o OP movement, like the organic portals search term. I'm finding it very interesting at the moment seems to be if your video catches the views going up and then those 
videos are staying up the top and then the views go up even more on them even though they might not necessarily be even introducing a new concept <laughs> it's just because that channel has more subscribers or something you know and then so the video initially gets more views goes to the top of the search term so i know i just I, I guess I should just say that because people are probably, some people would be seeing this like I am and know it's obvious, but some other people would be like, why is, you know, Ben's videos all down there? It's because, you know, if your videos are, are coming up more often, like if I do one video per day, I'm getting less views on that particular video. And then the next day I do another video. So then people are, you know, invested in that video. And the algorithm doesn't know what to choose as much on YouTube, you see. That's why my videos are all just like floating up and down <laughs> when you go in there. Because, I mean, look, yeah, honestly, in my opinion, some of my videos should be the first top video. Like the Organic Portal's definition video. Not one dislike. 67, 68 likes last time I checked. I think there was 67 likes last time I checked. No dislikes. Like a thousand... 200 views um, it's the organic portal definition video <laughs> I mean clearly you all kind of agree with it not one person has ever even pressed the dislike button on the video so clearly you all actually agree on it why isn't it and I've gone into like a very summarizative amalgamated view point of it and deep so, I mean, why is that way down the bottom in the search term and then you have a 30-second glib shit video up the top? You know what I mean? This is why I'm saying, watch out now, the NPCs are entering the organic portal movement and it's going to become a cacophony. You're not going to know, is Ben right? Is he wrong? You're going to have to think for yourself. It's going to force that upon you, you see? That is a general thing that... NPCs are being created more now. You know how there's some people out there, they say that NPCs are being created more now. I agree, and it's to force certain things like this, to force you to think for yourself. All right, my battery's running out.